Hey there loves, welcome and welcome back to my channel. How are y'all doing? I hope everybody is doing well and in good health. If you guys did not watch my last video, we played with a lot of styling on my buffet, aka my console table in the back where my bar area is. But today we're going to be playing with some decor on my coffee table. If you guys are up to date with my living room makeover, then you guys would know that this coffee table is a recent buy as well as our sofa or couch. So it's been a little difficult trying to style this black coffee table because I'm used to styling a brown coffee table. Then I painted that a off whitish grayish color and i've been styling that really nicely but now to style the black has been a little bit difficult so i want to go ahead and play with some looks so you guys let me know down below which look is your favorite and which look i should keep for my spring season because the girl has been struggling with getting this coffee table to look decent i mean i don't know what's going on but we're going to play with some decor and i hope you guys enjoy if you do enjoy please do consider giving me a thumbs up also subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed as yet both are very much free and i would definitely be happy to have you guys as a part of my hrl community for my first look, I'm going down with a set of white coffee table books and then next to that I'm going to add a white vase and then I'm going to add some greenery to the table. I usually like to go in with a simple greenery if not a plethora of flowers but this time we're going to keep it really really simple with just some greenery in the vase. My goal for this first styling was very simple but very luxe but of course affordable because on this channel y'all know we ball on a what? Budget. Yes ma'am. Yes sir. So I want to just go in with something very simple and I had these greenery. I'm using everything that I already have in my home to accomplish these looks but I wanted to go in with just greenery. Of course you can go in with florals if you wish but I really wanted to keep it nice and simple with some greenery. Next, I'm going in with this simple black square platter and on top of that, I'm adding this white vase with a piece of that green stem inside it. Next to that smaller vase on the platter, I'm also going to add in a candle as well as my DIY matchstick holder. For my final piece, I'm going in with my book and I found the most stunning page that I feel was just perfect for this entire look and this is how everything came together. I really hope I achieved what my goal was but of course you guys have to let me know down below what do you think about look number one. For my second styling, I really wanted something very simple because I know putting a lot of decor on your coffee table is not everyone's cup of tea. It's mine, but it's not everyone's cup of tea. So I wanted to take other persons into consideration who like a more minimalistic look. So I went in with my DIY vase and those same greeneries. Then to the other corner, I'm going to add a stack of books. I'm using a white one, a gray one, and a brown. Just trying to tie in all the colors that I'm using in this styling. Then next to that, I'm just going to add in my cement vase. So we have all of the colors added together from the books, from that vase that we added down first to the last vase. And you guys have to let me know what you think about this one. It's very minimalistic, so I hope you guys enjoyed this look as well.
for my third styling I feel like this look was very minimalistic as well I've never used a very tall base in any of my coffee table stylings so I wanted to give that a try so I went down with my newest vase then next to that I'm going to add a stack of books mostly white and then I went in later and changed it from this blue color because I just wasn't feeling it so I changed it to the gray book but I think the white books alone were perfect so I really didn't need that third book on top then I'm opening it up to another page that I feel complements all of the colors on the table this style is also very minimalistic so i hope you guys enjoyed this as well because i know i'm that girly that likes to put a lot of stuff on my coffee table so what do you guys think about look number three For my fourth and final look, I wanted to get, you know, a lot more glam with this one. And it is not minimalistic like the second and third, but it is a lot more luxe like the first look. And I absolutely love black and white on this table. So I went down first with my two white books, then I went in with that black coaster. And to my first white book, I'm going to add my DIY face and a lot of greenery. Next, I'm going to go in with another DIY decor piece that I made. It's actually just a cover that I added a handle to. And I feel like it looks like some type of art piece, but I really don't know what it is. I just saw something I liked and I wanted it to look as close to it as possible. So I made it. <laughs> Next, I'm going in with my black candle as well as this diffuser it is so good y'all i wish i could find this to link it for you guys but i could never find it to link it but it smells so 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 good it smells like a sexy man <laughs> anyways on to my platter i'm going to add some coasters as well as my diy matchstick holder and that is it for this look what do you guys think about look number four and which one was your favorite i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did please do remember to give me a big thumbs up it really does help my channel out as well as subscribe if you guys are not subscribed as yet and i will see y'all in my next video so until then alvida sing